we're here today to talk about the driving here at Crosby. Over the fall, we've had some reports of some driving type concerns, uh, and we obviously have safety of our students as a primary concern. And so we're here with Officer Cohn just to talk about some reminders of how to keep all of our students safe, how to just uh, obey traffic things, and how to make sure that our arrival and dismissal times at Crosby here are safe. So just kind of to remind parents and that coming here to Crosby about some of the safety features, particularly um, as we start out, um, you pull in here to Crosby on Hurley, just a reminder that the center area there is marked as a solid yellow line. I know some parents probably have seen our officers out there recently, and that's as a reminder that that's not a passing lane or that for you to avoid cars that may be backed up as we come up here into the parking lot there's lots of students coming be very cognizant of speed i can't stress it enough to go slow 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 sometimes the traffic will back up behind us is moringo road that's a very busy intersection and well-traveled thoroughfare uh, for people trying to avoid route 14 and 23 to get on to 23. just keep in mind if it's backed up or it's stopped you see cars maybe just taking a left going up a block maybe by the old uh, Sullivan's or that area turning around and coming back when the traffic is flowing that could help out the situation immensely. The other thing that I would encourage parents uh, is to have their kids ride the bus. Um, many of our students here at Crosby are eligible to ride the bus and I know there are times when you're headed out of town uh, for family reunions and family events that it's easier to pick up your student and get on the road rather than waiting for them to be delivered home but it really does reduce a lot of our traffic if we could have more parents pick uh, allow their students to ride the bus home that's a very safe way to get home and would reduce some of the traffic here so when all possible we'd encourage you to have your kid ride the bus home but I guess the biggest thing is please be patient we have a nice process designed here at Crosby to keep your students as safe as possible with the numbering system, the tags, and all of that is designed with safety in mind. But uh, that frustration of maybe and that temptation to drive around everyone in line to bypass them because you're in a hurry or drive in the exit is something we've seen. And I don't want it to be the point where uh, we're actually having to issue citations because those are driving violations. And is it correct that if that's seen, that would there would be a ticket issued? There is the potential, again, as I alluded to earlier, driving or crossing over that solid yellow line here on Hurley Drive could potentially lead uh, to you being stopped by an officer and an officer at their discretion could potentially issue citations for that. And I think that's something, you know, we're trying to work with the school district also to try to help alleviate the problem and don't want to put kind of that financial burden on families. Um, but if the situation doesn't resolve itself or continues to be an issue, I think maybe that is where it might be going down the road. Okay, so there's a little bit of just consideration. We hope it doesn't get to that point. So our mantra of uh, be respectful, be responsible, be safe could also apply to all of our drivers here. And we've seen some things that were a little bit of a concern, and that's our message with you today. Appreciate your cooperation. We just do care mostly about the safety of our students. Officer Cohen, thanks for joining me today. Appreciate all your uh, efforts to keep our community safe, not just our schools. Uh, obviously, you have a big uh, network in the community, and uh, all of our we have such a great relationship with the police department and all our community. We really value that and uh, thank you for all your hard work keeping us all safe. You're very welcome, Dr. Tavoy. Thanks everyone. Have a great day.